Hey guys, hope you're having a great day. We now have core locking in Windows, Awesome Miner. Well, it's not built into Awesome Miner, but it's here, T-Rex. So I'm locking all my 3060 Ti's to 1455. Not doing too much better, but my 20 series. Locking these guys down to 1,005. Locking these guys at 1,100. 86 watts for a 2080. Still getting 43. So freaking cool. Still playing around with it, but 20 series is amazing with locking this core. I used to fight all the time with these 2080s. I'd have some that would just totally down clock to 900 and not get anything. I'd start sitting at like 41, or they'd be wasting a ton of power running at 130 watts, and the core is sitting at 1600 megahertz. Like they're all over the place. So now that we can lock it down, it is so awesome. This 2060 Super still acts a little weird, but I had to do something different for that. But the basic concept of it is adding that lock C clock and then finding the right numbers for you. If you go over to GitHub, they've got a nice little range table here. But play around with yours. Like here they said, 36 T TIs need 1320 to 1370, but I needed 1455. And I did need to up the power a little bit. Used to run at 60 power. I had to give them a little bit more, 64, or else they would downclock under 1455. But I can keep playing around with this, but it's so cool. Locking all my clocks where I want them. 3070 is uh, doing the recording right now, so that's why it's not getting much right now. But anyway, check it out. Core locking. All right, I'll see you guys on the next one. Later.